our uh, transient for all summer long. But uh, in here we can usually fit about 30, 32 bolts pretty, pretty easily in here. And the most we had is 40, so we can usually find room for, for the boats that do come in. And if we don't have room for all the boats, we have good anchoring just off the end of our dock down here. And there's a pretty good hold, and we haven't had any complaints yet. In St. Ignace, as in Mackinac City, there are a number of good restaurants and lounges within walking distance. The Huron Landing is a short three-block walk from the state dock right on the waterfront. The Gandhi Dancer is also on the water just south of the marina. Emile's Grocery and Bentley's Restaurant are directly across the street from the docks. The Pizza Hut, which is also across from the docks, will deliver to your boat until 1 a.m. Glenn's Market is the largest supermarket in the Straits area. Approaching the Straits of Mackinac from the west, the unique bluffs of Mackinac Island will be to port, with Round Island to starboard. As you approach closer, you will see the Round Island Passage Light to port and the inoperative Round Island Lighthouse to starboard. It is, of course, reversed from the east. The Round Island Lighthouse, with its distinctive shape, colors, and location, should not be confused with any other lighthouse on the Great Lakes. As you near the harbor, give a fairly wide berth to the Round Island Passage Light. West Breakwater is directly behind it. The wide open harbor entrance is flanked on each side by a breakwater with navigational lights. Inside the East Breakwater is farthest from the relentless ferry traffic and provides the safest anchoring location while waiting for a slip. Transient slips are available on a first come, first served basis and are usually available within 24 hours. Showers are not available on the docks on Mackinac Island, but are available at the Mackinac Island Yacht Club directly across the street for a small fee. If you dock on the island, you must get around on a bicycle, on foot, or in a horse-drawn carriage since there are no cars allowed on the island. For many, a trip to Mackinac Island is a chance to experience what life was like before it was so dramatically changed by the automobile. All tastes and preferences are catered to on the island, from the elegance of the Grand Hotel to the pizza of Sarducci's. The best panoramic dining on the island is from the Fort Mackinac Tea Room, while the best view of the comings and goings in the harbor is from the Chippewa Hotel Dining Room. The Murray Hotel boasts the island's best deli and frozen yogurt selection, while the ninth hole overlooking the Grand Hotel Golf Course is the best spot to watch the golf